Good morning, my friends. Good morning. Good morning. Oh, my goodness me. I have been watching this guy for the last 15 minutes, debating with myself whether to take the video or continue with what I was doing. But it's been so stunning. Sorry, I just lost connection. It's a little less stunning in this moment, but still stunning. We can hear the crows welcome in the day. And there's been a light frost. You can see a light frost on the fields. And it's just so magical. I was sitting here working on my book I am just writing my autobiography and I'm on the second book of that. I choose this time in the mornings to write. Good morning, Nicola. And then I got a message from New Zealand from somebody that wanted to buy my healing book, Healing stress, anxiety and fear and she just messaged me all the way from New Zealand. Isn't that amazing? I'm astounded by how we can connect. And she was just saying how Glastonbury is such a magical place. Which indeed it is. So every morning at Healing Waters we have the opportunity to witness these are most amazing sunrises. And we have the tour here. And an opportunity every morning just to set our intentions for the day. As we go through this amazing time on planet Earth. It truly is amazing right now. And is calling upon us to really transform things that are holding us back. Sorry for the video, is a little bit jerky. Yeah, we've got so much to work upon and we've been through so much in the last few years. It's a beautiful dawn, yes, Nicola? It's so peaceful. So yes, it's wonderful to have this opportunity. And you saw the bird flying over every day to renew. And we just had the full moon, I think two nights ago in Leo. And it's a time for tremendous change on the planet. So just down below us, that's the pulley tunnel and the Glastonbury Healing Gardens. So I'm very excited because we are launching a new year of growing in opportunity. And next Tuesday we're having a volunteers day and I'm making some lovely soup from the gardens, from vegetables that I have stored in the gardens. And with everything that's happening, it's so important for us to be growing our own food. So for all of you who would like to be part of this and have the opportunity to have wholesome, fresh, organic food, then come along, contact me, see our Healing Gardens page and be part of this amazing project because it's so important to be able to grow at this time and to know that the food we're eating is good and wholesome from trusted sources. So let's just take a breath together in this moment and really expand our 
energy field, our light, because we are infinite beings of light that have incarnated at this time on the planet for a very specific purpose. And although times have been tough, we can really set that intention to truly radiate love and light on a daily basis because the world is what we create it to be and being aware of this, aware of our power is a very important step so just breathing into that knowing that you are an infinite being of light and holding that awareness powerfully makes a difference to your own self and to those around you that as you regulate your nervous system in this way and you send out a very real measurable nervous system regulation that others around you can pick up they can feel quite clearly what's happening in your nervous system we can entrain the nervous systems of those around us and we can see I don't know if you caught that wave of starlings. So magical in the mornings. As the starlings wake up on the levels, not far from here, on the nature reserves and come swooping across the sky. So this is what I teach in my online healing program and in my book, is how to regulate our nervous system. and co-regulation and how this enables us to stay relational and open in a truly resourced and grounded way. So taking a breath again into that knowing and being aware of your body in this moment as you witness this beautiful sunrise. And allowing your shoulders to drop. Allowing your jaw to soften. Feeling your feet on the ground. Being aware of your hands, the palms of your hands. Just allow intention to leave your face for your cheekbones to soften. For your jaw to drop. And bring in your awareness to your heart. Breathing into your heart. Breathing into the knowing that you are an infinite being of light. And that you can truly make a difference in the world. And allowing your heart field to expand at this time. And that it reaches out. And we can hear the starlings. A 
amazing starlings. I don't know if you can see them. Huge blocks of them just gone over. So allowing that heart field to fully expand. Knowing how powerful that is. And touching your loved ones. Embracing your loved ones. And expanding out around the planet. And even those that you would view as an enemy or that you would have negative feelings about. Just allowing them to be touched by this field of love. And just holding the awareness of loving kindness. May I be well. May I be happy. May I be free from suffering. Another huge flock of starlings. And may all beings be well. May all beings be happy. And may all beings be free from suffering. And just offering that up in this moment as a prayer and an intention for the day. Om Mani Padme Hum. Om Shanti. Om Shanti. Om Shanti. Have a beautiful day, my friends. Have a beautiful day, Nicola. And may you be blessed. May you be blessed. With love. And bye for now.